Outdoor School is a three-day program. Uh, they come in just before noon on Wednesdays and have lunch. And then we teach them uh, two nature classes and then supper and evening of activities with campfires or night hikes, uh, games out on the field. On the full day of Tuesday, they do multiple uh, events on the challenge course. So team challenge or high ropes or the climbing tower and zip line. Uh, they alternate between those two morning and evening and then more evening activities. And then additional two uh, nature classes on Wednesday morning and they finish up with lunch and pack up and are typically home about the time school would get out on Wednesday. On average, we run outdoor school for 16 weeks a year, eight in the spring and eight in the fall. Uh, it varies a little bit from year to year uh, when schools wanna switch from fall to spring or spring to fall. Uh, we have, uh, I'm gonna say about 22, 24 schools that participate. I like about, the thing I like about outdoor school is that I really get to connect with nature more and better because not, Usually in these times, sometimes you don't really get the um, kids don't really get to go outside, they stay indoors and play video games all day. But the fact that I just get to be here with my friends, um, hang out, talk about stuff, and be in nature, yeah, it really does spark the um, feeling inside. It makes you feel warm. I like the 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 chance to do things like this. Like you go to a place like a camp, and you can do stuff like a rock wall and you can you can do zip lines and you get to go inside. Like the outdoor activities are fun but some of the indoor activities are also really fun like learning to tie knots and all that kind of stuff. So I'm just really grateful that, uh, the, that my school just offers that and I'm glad that I'm able to do it. So outdoor school is actually a curriculum requirement in the state of Maryland for sixth grade. So really our purpose for doing this is to connect them to God's first book. Uh, he created nature for Adam and Eve to live in and to see who he is uh, and had to give us a written book because we just didn't follow the, nature, the natural one.